Hello and welcome back to another episode of Physics Partner. Today we are diving into the fascinating world of mechanical equilibrium. But first, what is mechanical equilibrium? Mechanical equilibrium occurs when the sum of all forces and torques acting on an object is zero. In simpler terms, it's the state of balance where an object experiences no net force or torque. This means the object can be at rest or moving at a constant velocity. Now let's delve deeper into the types of mechanical equilibrium. There are three types, stable, unstable and neutral equilibrium. To illustrate this, imagine a metal ball placed at the bottom of a concave surface. When the ball is at rest, it's in stable equilibrium because if it is displaced slightly, it returns to its original position. On the other hand, if the ball is perched on the top of the convex surface, it's in unstable equilibrium. Any slight disturbance will cause the ball to roll off. Lastly, neutral equilibrium is like balancing a ball on a plane surface. It neither returns to its original position nor falls off. Now let's explore how the size and center of mass of rectangle boxes affect their equilibrium on an inclined plane. When a smaller box with its center of mass position lower is placed on an inclined plane, it's more stable compared to a larger box with its center of mass position higher. This demonstrates how the distribution of mass and size can impact the equilibrium of object on inclined surface. Finally, the talk about the iconic tower of Pisa. Despite its famous lean, the tower has maintained its mechanical equilibrium for centuries. This is due to the careful engineering of its foundation, which counteracts the gravitational force and prevents further tilting. It's a remarkable example of how understanding mechanical equilibrium can lead to innovative solution in architecture and engineering. Mechanical equilibrium plays a crucial role in various real-life applications. From the stability of structures and buildings to design the vehicles and machinery, engineers and architects rely on the principle of mechanical equilibrium to ensure the safety and functionality of their creations, ultimately contributing to the advancement of technology and infrastructure. In conclusion, understanding mechanical equilibrium is essential for comprehending the behavior of objects under different conditions and environments. Whether it's the stability of a simple ball or the architectural marvel of the Tower of Pisa, the concept of equilibrium shapes our physical world in profound ways. So I think it's enough for today. So thank you very much for listening and watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this video is useful for you. So take care of yourself and don't hesitate to write an email if you have any question, query, suggestion and even classes are required. Take care of yourself meanwhile. See you in the next video. Goodbye.